In this video, I'll cover how to install all the required tools and build your first Geode mod. This tutorial is for Windows. If you're on Mac or Linux, you can follow the guide linked in the description. Links to all the things you need to download will also be in the description. If you haven't done any coding in C++ before, then I highly recommend learning the basics before you start modding. There's plenty of good tutorials out there. Okay, so we're going to start off with a compiler, so you're going to go to this website, link in the description. And you're going to scroll down, you'll see Tools for Visual Studio, click that. Scroll down a bit more and you have Build Tools for Visual Studio 2022, and you're going to press Download. Now you're going to run it. Then you're going to select Desktop Development with C++, and press Install. Next, we're going to install CMake, again, link in the description. So we're going to download the installer. And run that. Next, we're going to install Git. So click Download for Windows and get the setup. Run that. Next, we're going to install Scoop. So you're going to open up PowerShell. And you're going to copy and run these two lines, which will be in the description. Now you're going to run Scoop Bucket Add Extras. And lastly, Scoop Install Geode SDK CLI. And you can do geo.version to check that it's installed. And now you're going to run geode config setup. So I left this blank, but it ended up causing problems later. So just type win, W-I-N. Now you're going to open Steam. Right click GD. Manage browse local files. And you need to find geometry.exe. And click copy as pass. Then you can paste that here and just remove the quotes. And uh, then you can give it a name, you can name it whatever you want. And now that's done. Then you're going to do geode sdk install. If you don't want to install in this default path, then you can specify your own. Now you have to restart the terminal. And type echo dollar m on geode underscore sdk, and that should say the directory that you set it to. And now you need to install the binary, so you're going to do geode sdk install binaries. If you want to install the binaries for another platform like Android, you can do dash b and then Android 32, 64, Mac OS. In order to update geode, it's a geode sdk update. You can also switch to the nightly branch by just running that or back to stable. And every time you update it, you should also install the binaries again. Now we're going to set up the editor. So if you don't have it, we're going to go back here and download Visual Studio Code. To create a mod, you're going to type geode new. Then you can put the name of the mod version developer which is just your name and a description and confirm the location you can just see the defaults on these now you can go into the directory mod type code dot all right so now you have it open in vs code and you're going to start by on the left clicking the extensions and you want to install the C, C++ extension. You also need the C, C++ extension pack. And the Geode extension. You can see the code in source main. It's just the default code. Now to get rid of these errors and build it, you're going to press F1. You're going to do scan for kits. Now you're going to do select a kit. 
and you're going to select Visual Studio Build Tools 2022 release AMD64. Again, F1 and Edit Configurations. And you're going to scroll the way down to the bottom, click Advanced Settings. And right here, you're going to do ms-vscode.cmake-tools. You can close that. Now you can finally build the mod by again pressing F1. And you're going to run CMake Build. Now you can run Geometry Dash. And you'll see there's a like button here, and it says hello from my custom mod. I recommend looking through the comments in the code, as it does a good job explaining what everything does, and there are a bunch of tutorials on the Geode website. I'll also be uploading more tutorials soon, so yeah.